What's up everybody? Hope everyone's well. This is All Pro Exterior Services again coming at you with another video. Uh, got talked into incorporating uh, injector bypass onto my reel or into my system rather. So this is what I got set up. Uh, this is all just hand tight, no, nothing hardwired in or anything like that. So, but I always try to lead in with my coupler and the flow goes out with the the male uh, the nipple the 3 8 uh, male nipple so anyway this is kind of something I'm gonna put in and the main reason I'm doing this is for surface cleaning so when I'm surface cleaning I can open this up and get more flow and if I want to use the uh, injector I just turn it off and it'll force the feet force the water through the hose and I can pull out the injector with that said since I got two reels and two machines I didn't want to run another drop tube to the SH tank. So what I did is I got one of these, another three-way quarter inch valve. So this will be sitting here. This injector will run here. The other injector will run here. And this will go to the bleach tank. So if I want to run the nine gallon a minute downstream, I just switch it to the nine. If I want to run, one, want to run the four, I switch it over to the four. And I can run that one. So if if my helper's surface cleaning, ball valve open, switch this over. I'm on a four gallon a minute spraying. So that's the intent here. So I also got me another extra hose. All this from Southside Equipment, Russ Johnson, good people. So anyway, I'm gonna probably use my old injector still working. I'll keep this as a backup. So we'll get that fixed up. So let me get the tape in here. All right, everyone, here's the bypass setup that I chose to go with and how I chose to set it up. I got the ball valve in line for the flow, so when I'm using the surface cleaner, this is going to be on. When I'm not, I just turn it off. And it kind of fits really neat because it goes around this little cross beam for the uh, pressure washer mount. So next, I'm going to run my injector line. I got to split this off, off the box, again with this three-way ball valve, so I can choose what rail I'm downstream to. Not only that, I want to recommend that if you're using Teflon tape, this Blue Monster is amazing. I, I was using a white tape for a while, and it would leak every now and then, and I haven't had a leak with this stuff since I bought it. So, it, you know, if you can get some of this, I think I got it on Amazon, just Google it or whatever. You can figure it out. But, yeah, so I'm going to tee into this, and I got the injector in this 4-gallon-a-minute reel and in this 9-gallon-a-minute reel. So, again... I can run that and I can do my downstream with the remote, with the remote box, or if I'm surface cleaning, just do that and bypass the injector, which is going to be awesome. So, all right, let me get this other stuff set up and uh, I'll show you the final product. Peace. Well, here's the setup. Got the bypass, put a tie strap on the frame just to kind of keep the hose from jumping around. Got the uh, three-way ball valve, one going so this injector for the nine gallon, the other one coming here for the four gallon on the other reel. So tied into my injector box. So it comes off the injector box into the ball valve, out two ways, one to each reel. So left is the left reel, which is the nine gallon. Or if I want to downstream with the four gallon reel, I just turn it over to four gallon. And a remote system will work for either one I'm on. So when I'm surface cleaning, or I got my guy surface cleaning, open the open the bypass valve, flow, bypassing the injector, get maximum flow. And I could be downstreaming with this, or if we get to a house not doing the driveway and I want to use the big machine, I could just turn this, done, turn the valve to the left for the left reel, and I'm on. And by the way, these caps come off, so you might as well take them off cheap caps or put some silicone or something in it if you want to really keep it but anyway that that I think that setup's going to work really good so I'm happy with that I'm, I'm excited to try to bypass with the because uh, I've been using it with the injector in it all the time so that's about it guys I'm a, got a bunch of jobs to do it's kind of cloudy and cold here so we're kind of waiting to see what's going to happen but uh, I need to get some stuff done and uh, the, the, the quoting board and job scheduling is backed up. So again, we're blessed. 
But again, use this monster tape, this blue monster. It's really good. It's not that expensive. That's all I got for you today, folks. We're going to go ahead and I'm cleaning up a little bit so we can get ready to see what we're going to do. Go do a couple of jobs and I get some footage of that. Anyway, appreciate it. Like, sub, comments, calls. Keep them coming. Peace.